Good morning guys and girls, it's Stacy here with another episode of Stardew Valley and it looks as though we've got some crops that are growing so we've got some tulips happening, we've got some blue jazz and we've got some parsnips so we're going to have to deal with that in a minute uh, Do we have anything going on in here? Yep, we've got some strawberries We've got some more ancient fruit Wow, everything's starting to happen Okay, so yeah, I guess we're going to be harvesting crops to start with and then We'll try and work out whatever it else is that we need to do today. So let's just have a quick look at our achievement list. Our, not achievement list, our collection list. So we've managed to finish off this one, which means that we got the achievement, where where was it? Ship every item. We got the full, sh full shipment achievement. So now we've got the museum collection, the cooking, crafting every item, and shipping 15 of each crop. So... Let's see, to complete the museum collection we're going to need all of these. I don't know where to find them all. We only need two more rocks. Um, and cooking we still need two more recipes I think. We don't have. So we, we can't really do those. But we should be able to do this craft master. And I reckon... I reckon we almost can do polyculture. I reckon when we have enough ancient fruit, that will be it. Although maybe we need the sweet gem berries as well. Hmm. Maybe I should start collecting those. Okay, so I've replanted all of the crops. Got everything going. So it's mostly garlic and potatoes. I think the only thing I've got left... Yeah, I've got some parsnip seeds left. Um, yeah, we'll do those next time. But we're going to have to go to Pierre's because we don't have actually that much left in the way of seeds and we've got plenty of spring left to go. So, oh, oh, that's really sweet. I was just going to give you a present. Yay. And the cat is right in the way. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we're going to have to end up getting more seeds. But in the meantime, I think... What... Hmm, I could go to Clint. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go to Clint's place. I'm going to buy more coal and get these geodes done. Because, yeah, we've got so much, like, ridiculous amounts of iron ore and all that. We can always sell it to get more money to get the coal to pay for doing more of it. But, yeah, we just don't have enough. So I think that's probably a matter of priority. And then we might come back and start doing a little bit more of the paths, try and f just finish refining how we're laying out this farm, I think. So we will... Clint first, and then if we get to Pierre's on time, we can grab some more seeds. And other than that, um, mostly just tidying up the farm. Or we could go slay six red slimes in the deep lava caves. I mean, that's also a thing. That could be fun. I don't know. Clint first, though. And hopefully we will get to him in time. Yep, he's still here. Good. Okay, process geodes, please. Hopefully we'll get something new. Doesn't look like it. No, nothing new. That's okay. We don't have tools to upgrade. We should probably do that at some point. We've got the iridium now. Um... I should probably also come and sell some of my stuff. Alright, we're going to need a lot of coal. Let's buy 250 coal. And yes, I'm well aware that that was a little bit over the top, but, you know, that means we don't have to come back here for a while. It makes sense, right? It, we're being efficient. Alright, let's go up to the lava caves. No, let's go to Pierre's first. Buy a whole bunch of seeds, then we'll go and get rid of six slimes. And then we'll go back to the farm and start burning things. Okay, I don't have that much money because I spent so much on coal. Um, what do I want? Should totally have got speed grow and stuff. Deluxe speed grow. Uh, what is going on? What can I get? Nothing, nothing more that I don't already have. Okay, uh, I could 
could do potatoes. I could do cauliflowers. If I do cauliflower, I'd have to plant them tomorrow. I might do 96 cauliflower, because I'm pretty sure I've got a crop that will be finishing tomorrow. Oh, hey! It's time the bushes to... Oh, it's time for the salmon berries. That's kind of good. I think we're going to spend a bit of time chasing after berries this season. Because, yeah, it's just free stuff that goes in the keg, and we're going to make so much money off all of that. Now... Ah, uh, yes. You're not what I was looking for, but I'll kill you anyway, because every little bit adds up. And we are trying to get the monster quest goal. And I'll take the diamond. Alright, nothing else to be found. Let's jump to 115. It's very pink in here right now. Nothing to be found here. Uh, back to 105. Oh yes, here's one. Good. One down, five to go. We are absolutely smashing them. And I heard something ding, so I reckon we've got enough slimes. It's good that we decided to come down one. Uh, let's have a look. Yep, we just have to go talk to Lewis. This time of night, he's going to be at the pub. So let's do that. I can't be bothered getting the gold. We've got way too much of it. I mean, if I want, ever want gold or anything else, I just come down here and in 10 minutes I'll have whatever I need, so... Yeah. Let's go talk to Lewis. If we can get to the pub on time. Oh! We just walked in here and there's a cutscene? Um... Okay, I was not expecting this. I thought we had every single cutscene in the game. Um, sure. Um, okay. Oh, right. Because Clint's in love with Emily, but before I was married, Emily was a candidate for me. But now I'm married. Right. Um, well spotted. Yep. Um. Well, being yourself is something that you seem to be incapable of doing around Emily. You're always, like, gulping and, you know, being too... Treating her like an object rather than a person. Um... And nobody ever wants somebody crazy. He, he can't be charming. Like, he's got strength, but he can't be charming because he can't even talk around her. So, like, for him, I reckon, I mean, I think the best thing that Clint could do would be to treat her the same as he treats anybody else. Which means not seeing her as an object of desire and seeing her as a person. So I'm going to hit the last one here. It's not general advice, guys. <laughs> But, you know, it might work for Clint. <laughs> people are people. No matter who they are. Yes? I would order a drink, mate. You kind of failed already. Stop looking at her like she's an object for your, like, gaze or whatever. She's person. Ooh. Is he going to ask her? Because I reckon you should. Never mind. Oh. Bad luck, Clint. Better luck next time. See, do what Shane does. Small talk. Chat. See? They're clearly friends because he treats her like a person. It's not rocket science. Wow, we have got a lot of stuff going on here. So, 
I've been trying to run through some of our stuff in the dairy chest, in the animal products chest, because there's just so much of it. And I'm just trying to, like, just get through it, really. It's taking forever. I should never let it get this out of control. Uh, truffle as well. But, yeah, on the plus side, we are actually getting to a point where, as soon as those cakes are finished, we're going to have a fair amount of stuff to go through. So we've got 67 goat cheese. We're getting up some normal cheese as well. So, oh, and I don't know if you guys noticed, but I sold a lot of the jelly. I kind of figured there wasn't much point hanging on to it. All it's good for is gifts. So, I wonder if this mead can go in these kegs. I really want to know. I'm really curious. I don't think the pale ale can. I'm pretty sure the coffee can't. Maybe I should sell some of that. I might take it out of the chest so that I remember it's not meant to live there. Oh, and put the strawberries in there. I'm just selling every. I'm just making everything into wine. One can never have too much wine. Oh, something's happening. Something's happening overnight. That was a really loud noise. I don't know what it was. So, I guess as soon as we get out of here, we're going to find out. Yep, sold things. Good, good times. I feel like it might be another one of those Iridium meteors. An explosion was heard in the night. Yep. Um. That is not the wallpaper I had yesterday. Oh. Is that what the explosion in the night was? You were doing the wallpaper. Uh. Sure. Um, I actually don't mind that wallpaper. It's alright. It's a bit darker than I was sort of hoping, but it'll do. Alright, let's get these on, eggs on, before I do anything else. Oh, welcome surprise. There is a rabbit's foot in here. Not that I really have a use for it anymore, but it's always nice to sort of know that my animals love me enough to drop their feet. Yeah. I feel like that should, shouldn't really be a thing. I shouldn't be taking the feet off my rabbits. But I am. Okay, there is nowhere for me to plant cauliflowers today. Aha! Aha! I knew this would be around here somewhere. Get off. Okay. There we go. Okay, so it looks like I can have another patch of farm here and it will be fine if I have another four iridium sprinklers. Okay, it looks like it's time to plant. Man, we are making so much money this season. This is, this is unbelievable. Get all of these seeds in. Yep. Great. Almost there. Get the horse out the way. Perfect. I guess we should sort of have a look and see what we can do in this area over here. So, one, two, three, four, five. Is that right? One, two, three, four. Yep. Yeah. So if we were to use this area here as part of a f as part of the farm, we'd put. Yeah. So we'd be missing. Um. We'd be missing a corner, which is not terrible. We could probably just do it around in a three or something. Or why don't I just remove some of these and we'll do this patch here, get this one ready. Yeah, drag this all the way down here. And so one, two, and the bottom 
comes in here. Okay, we've got an outline. We have an outline, even if it's not a good one. And yeah, um, the grass can grow all the way up here. And we can have grass all the way down the bottom along there. I think, yeah, we'll, we'll work out something to make that look neat. We've got our trees growing there, slowly. And maybe we'll have another two patches down here, or maybe we'll just have grass. I haven't decided yet. Anyway, guys, that is it for today. We have done so much this episode. I think we've done three days instead of two. So, yeah, we've covered a lot of Stardew Valley time. So, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Um, if you did, please leave a like. If you really loved it, make sure to subscribe. And I'm just going to go give my husband a gift. And then after that, we will finish up. So, where is my frozen tear? Frozen tear. There we go. Surely he's going to get sick of them sooner or later. And there we go. So, yeah, thanks guys for watching. And, oh. He's trying to quit smoking. Fantastic. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.